So I can challenge you. Can somebody put a photo or share with Jyoti like if you have so sort of similar experience somewhere other than in Alberta? Wow. Let's have a while. Let's do it. <laughs> Good challenge, right? I love it. Why not? Here we are kayaking the spring lake. Oh, oh cold! Ah, it's chilly. Hello everyone! Here we started kayaking in Spray Lake Reservoir here in Canmore. Oh, hi! How are you feeling? Oh, it's fun! It's not too cold, right? Uh, looks cold, but not cold. Not too cold. It looks cold, <laughs> feels warm. Exactly. Yeah, so weather is a little bit smoky here today. I think the smoke came from all the way from California, right? I think so. Yeah, so mountains are not so clear uh, there is not clear visibility of the mountain uh, but not too bad so spray lake here in alberta this is really cool so really big lake here or the one of the finest lake for kayaking or paddling i guess exactly so warm water yeah in between mountains exactly beautiful no rust no rust no more traffic here right not much people and the good thing we explored today is that area is the campground right yeah, so you can camp and kayak and then hike and bike exactly so it's only 30 bucks guys you can just come in there and self uh, register and do the camping overnight and do the kayaking you'll have yeah. access to the lake from your own campground if you are an outdoor guy loving camp you can save 200 dollar of hotel cost at 30 dollar of camping cost that's true <laughs> yeah it's so awesome and we went today driving all the way up to that mountain there uh, we passed this lake so this is really huge lake i think it was about 10 kilometer we saw the lake right the reservoir yeah i think so so and then if you just come from canmore by the grassy lake area um Kananaski and i think you have a video of grassy lake too right yeah yes guys if you want to see we did the hiking in grassy lake trail so if you want to see the grassy lake uh, trail hiking video there is a beautiful lake grassy lake trail um yeah i posted this link will be right over here somewhere for you guys nice so do we want to go further up all the way up to there and then we'll just come around and go back right yeah so our aqua marina here is still helping us right yeah, I think so. We are still riding our aqua marina. So I think this is the sixth or seventh kayaking uh, with our kayak, inflatable kayak. It's really good so far. Only the problem with one, this one is it's all is like one of the four yeah. doesn't sit properly in place. That's true. I guess they can work hard on it. Mm -hmm. The rest we are ready to come in, but you get drafting quite uh, fast. <laughs> You're right. Yeah, so let's show 360 view for our uh, subscribers here. So I'm gonna show you the 360 view for, for the lake, okay guys? So, let's go! So we are heading to right over there to that fountain and then we might just make a loop and go back all the way to where we started there so that's the plan and let's see how further we can go yeah we can see the peak of the mountain from here see that mountain looks like a someone just saved it right like that wow those are those are nice mountains right oh, yeah. right so it's like someone <laughs> cut it with a sharp knife there. Uh, cut it with a sharp knife. Right? <laughs> wow. Looks nice. Super. I love Mother Nature. You know, enjoying with Mother Nature, you cannot get with your money. Right? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. 
uh, look at our brother, he's very expert of kayak and hiking. Learning. <laughs> it's fun. Yeah. Right, so hiking in Edit Cavill Meadow or uh, what do we call uh, that big beehive or David Devil Sum, that's nothing for him. So he can just climb the mountain without any climbing it's fun, poles. Guys, you can. Without yeah, any poles. Alberta, you know, we not only produce oil but we produce good nature, we preserve nature. Yeah. Yeah, guys, when I came uh, really early uh, back in 2012 and 13, I was thinking like, Alberta is boring. You know, we just started exploring here in Banff and Jasper National Park area and Kelowna, BC, that area. It's really beautiful, really awesome. And I'm really enjoying my days here. And there are still lots of places to visit in Canada, right? So Eastern Canada is more beautiful there and very pretty here. Lots of places to visit. I think we should go back. Uh, so we'll just go to that mountain, just by that corner. And then we'll just make a loop and go around and go back. So it was awesome uh, hiking here today. Probably this is the last kite for this summer, right? The fall is started already, so and now it will be snow and cold here in Canada. Tomorrow you are going to show them Lark Valley, right? Yes, guys, stay tuned. So, so tomorrow, how will those Lark look like? Like those? Oh yeah, Th those those those, stuff? those large uh, trees looks like those. You guys can see their yellow oranges color. So we'll see the whole valley, the whole jungle of larches. Yeah, they say it is fantastic. Yeah, so, so guys make a note in your diary for a trip next year. <laughs> Absolutely. Probably if you want more clarification, explanation, something more detailed, mm -hmm. contact our Jody Busao. He'll give you more information where to stay, where to camp. For How sure. To make it more economic. Mm -hmm. And Maybe it's, and what it, other stuff you can carry with you. Correct. And it's all free of charge. Just shoot me an IM or, or DM or you guys email. Money, you know, like you said, money in hotel, you said money in like kayaking because you may say, oh, I couldn't do this. Yeah. I could have done that. But yeah, there are things you can do very well if you plan ahead. Correct. Very nice. And then you will enjoy it definitely in Rockies. Absolutely. Then later tonight <laughs> we wanna go we will be so tired. We wanna go have some drinks. Yeah. There are good nice breweries around Canmore and Bath. Yeah, there is a local there is a local ale beer here in Canmore that's really famous. So yeah, if we get chance we'll try it that tonight. Only the thing you have to get inside wearing mask now because of 2019 COVID. Yeah. What is oh, this? I need your help to go up to there. What is this flipping? It is oh. Like that. oh, this is so calm here. Huh? Right? Did you remember? Like a, the other side was so windy. Now we are here close to mountain. Yeah. And there is no wind here, this side. Exactly. Right? Yeah. And it's warm here this side. It's so hot here. Yeah. Hot, wow. This side is See, really cool. You will not believe. It is amazing. You feel cold there. <laughs> yeah. Maybe in 500 meters. See, and we, we you feel warm here in another 500 meters. Yeah. And we wanted to return, right? So just two minutes back, we wanted to return because we started getting cold oh, here. Cold and windy. It was now chilly. It was so warm. I want to take my jacket off. <laughs> yeah. Now we are close to this mountain here. It's okay. I can. <laughs> be with jacket for a while. Okay. Okay, let's go over there and this okay, that, uh, mountain is blocking the wind, that's why. Yeah, I think so. Okay, let's go there and then we'll just make yeah, a loop I and then we'll go back. Coming. Okay, let's do it. We are here, other side. Wow. <laughs> I guess we did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. it was a canoeing and kayaking after like so long. I feel a little tired today. Yeah, so we need to turn around because the, the there is not depth. Yeah, that's right, right. So we are turning back here, guys. 
so reached to our destination here so now we are oh, heading back that? Well, lucky that was yeah that was strong you saw it otherwise yeah. like, we would have reached it man <laughs> exactly so now we are heading back so you guys can see we get we came all the way from there over there so now we're just making a loop and going back just see wow. okay it looks like there are stones here in this like sometimes. this area yeah. this side is a lot of lots of stones here Oh wow, this mountain looks awesome too, right? Looks like this mountain is leaning here, that one is leaning here. Looks like, you know, they are doing Namaste <laughs> to us, right? Namaste means what? You have namaste. Explain. What is Namaste means? This is how you do Namaste. We do that in It's in Asian, Nepal. like generally in Nepalese Indian culture, right? Like when we welcome people. Yes, that's correct. Guys, you have to visit Alberta. Just don't listen too much on what others are saying. Come here, enjoy, have fun. You know, like you help nature, help yourself too, by which gives you a good exercise, good relaxation, mm -hmm. yeah, good peace of mind. That's you right. are away from like jungle of concrete and uh, into the you're beautiful, a... pure oh, mother nature where you get this fresh air, fresh water. And with all the nature and the fresh water and the kayak and these activities, your stress will go away, right? Yes. Now I'm feeling like a very light and... So I, it gives you a sort of confidence here, like when you are with this, uh, with this place where, uh, you know, you can just enjoy, relax. Even you see, you can just relax like this. <laughs> no yep. kayaking, you're tired, take a rest, take your time. That's true and enjoy these mountains so i can challenge you can somebody put a photo or share with jyoti like if you have so sort of similar experience somewhere other than in alberta wow let's, have a let's do it <laughs> good challenge right i love it why not yeah absolutely because we also want to go there and see mm -hmm. sounds great Okay, time to go back. So now we gonna be uh, rushing a little bit. So let's do fast like a sports time. Okay, sports sport on. 